the Health Watch tonight a growing number of complaints about a popular form of birth control that some say is causing serious health problems. Now consumer advocate Aaron Brockovich says Congress needs to get involved. There in your side health reporter Stephanie Stahl explains. For months, Tanya Lovis suffered with mysterious pain. The mother of two says the symptoms were so severe she could barely tolerate doing even basic things. I was literally walking around hunched over holding my stomach. For 10 months, doctors couldn't figure out what was wrong. Tanya started researching online and found she wasn't alone. That's when I put two and two together. Women also started reaching out to activist Erin Brockovich. Look at these women's story. Is it a bad product? And if it is, let's remove it. The stories are concerns about a permanent form of contraception called Eshore. The products claim it's more effective than tying your tubes and is surgery free. As seen in this video provided by Eshore's manufacturer, Bear, coils are inserted into the fallopian tubes. Tissue then grows around the coils and seals the tubes. They said you'll have a little bit of cramping afterwards and you can go back to work tomorrow. Clearly, these things did something to me and I knew it. Tanya was eventually told she needed radical surgery. Brockovich says she heard similar complaints from other women. So I started a website and was actually very overwhelmed how quickly it built from you know, 50 to a couple of hundred to now thousands of stories of women. Brockovich hopes to collect 5,000 signatures on her website from women who've had problems with Eshore. Bear says Eshore was approved by the FDA in 2002 and is used by 750,000 women worldwide. The company also says Eshore has a well documented benefit risk profile with over 400 peer reviewed publications and abstracts supporting Eshore's safety, efficacy, and cost effectiveness. Gynecologist Amanda Yunker thinks Eshore is safe and says she hasn't heard of many complications, but acknowledges it's not for everyone. When I started taking them out and found that their pain resolved, then we realized that yes, Eshore can cause pain in a small subset of patients. After a full hysterectomy, which included removing Eshore coils, Tanya says her pain has disappeared. Oh, I feel amazing. I feel like a new woman. I feel like they've replaced my body with another woman's body. Bear also says no form of birth control is without risk or should be considered appropriate for every woman. We have a lot more information for you on all this at CBSPhilly.com. Click on health. I'm Stephanie Stahl, CBS3 Eyewitness News.